Well, from the beach to the courts, pickleball is becoming more popular. Courts are popping up all across the valley, and one local man is using the sport to get back in shape. Yeah, Mary Jane Belieza joining us live this morning with his story. And Mary Jane, here's the thing. John and I haven't played pickleball, but we're so excited about this. And kind of, I mean, not only is it fun, but I mean, it's a good way to get in shape, huh? Oh, you know, John and Heather, absolutely. I mean, I have gotten a few rounds in just before uh, oh. our six o'clock hour here, just so I could also prep myself. And the really cool part is this is really accessible to the community. There's a lot of courts actually for free in many areas across the valley, including Henderson, Summerlin, and of course, Miles Reynolds. He's been getting up and early and, and playing for us, too. He's going to be joining me here right now. Miles, I'm going to have to ask you to step aside here. He is the owner of Sport Court in the Las Vegas Valley. And Miles, we've been talking about this all morning long, just how easy and accessible it is for the community. You've been growing your business by pretty much building all these courts across Las Vegas. Tell me, where can people go if they want to play? Uh, the easiest place to find out what's close to you is uh, Pickleball has a, a nationwide website that's USAPA Pickleball. And you uh, put in your zip code and it'll show you what courts are close to you, how many courts there are, you know, when, when the times are best to play. So that's the best resource as far as what's close to you. And then even just going on the city's website, uh, they have a lot of leagues for kids, adults, and, and really all ages. And what's really nice, too, is that you have seen this really boom over the last couple of years, even more so in the summer when people are trying to get out and about, but still find a way to have uh, a good time while enjoying it for free. And so where have you been kind of building all all of these courts around the valley? You know, it's a mix because we do both commercial and residential. So, what we see happening is a lot of new construction, both, uh, you know, in the backyard or a lot of these communities are taking these older tennis courts that aren't being used as much and converting them to pickleball. Wow, that's awesome. And of course, I know that we were talking about in the last half hour that I'm going to take a shot here. I mean, we've been having a little bit of fun. So, now it's my turn to get on the court and hopefully I can get a good uh, shot because this is my first time, right? So, yes. I got to jump in here. All right. There it is. Oh, nice oh, nice forehand. Oh, Volley. Oh. Mary Jane's got it. You know, Wimbledon's oh, underway right now. Wimbledon's oh, underway. Wimbledon's happening now. I feel like Mary Jane. There you go. <laughs> Mary Jane's getting aggressive. Did you see that? Launch oh, it. Oh, it to her. It's not tennis, Mary Jane. <laughs> they won the point. She's going for the line. Next thing we know, she's going to be in the neighbor's house. But did you see a pickleball go across? You get the dogs barking at you. They're like, again. <laughs> It is getting, there she goes. Many times. Thanks, Mary Jane. Okay. Good it's job. Be, it is becoming more popular, to be sure. I got to get on this. Got to do it. We had the that big, there was good. the big, uh, Clark County had a big tournament, a, a pickleball tournament. I want to say it was at Sunset Park, I think. And yeah. they had yes. some courts down there, uh, Commissioner Gibson down there, and they, it was a big, big deal. Okay. And, and then they, at the Plaza Hotel, mm -hmm. they had the roof the of the plaza. Yeah, mm -hmm. so it's, it's getting Really? There. We got to get into it.